Welcome everybody to a surprise Saturday stream. Lads, I think this is actually a surprise because I'm surprised I'll be playing this game again. The reason why we're back on Saturday playing this terrible game is because I managed to find a way how to get past that area that was bugged. It wasn't tech, lads. It wasn't technically bugged, but we figured a way around it. And I think we are maybe two to three fetch quests away from being able to end the game. <laughs> So, lads, we are streaming for as long as it takes today to finish this absolute travesty of a game in preparation for Dragon's Dogma, which I will be uninstalling this game and then installing Dra Dragon's Dogma directly after it. So, let's do this, baby. Okay. I think, um, I think we're ready. We have maybe two or three fetch quests left to do. And we should be in the end game. Lads, it's been a long time coming. And I just, I've got a feeling that we're going to get a spanner thrown in, in the works here. But mine Dark Elidium. We need like two more. I think I'm getting air sick. We know where they are. They're down here. Come on, baby. End game. I want to see what the last boss is. I bet there's not even a last boss. <laughs> Wouldn't even be surprised. Dark Elidium. I don't actually know how mu how much we need. <laughs> right, that's not it. Here's some. Is this some? Oh, but two. Oh, that's not good. More. I wouldn't mind this heal while we're there. Oh, I don't feel so hot. Nearly dead, that's fine. I think this should be it. Oh, we got loads from that. Right, we've got it. Let me just double check. Dark Elidium. And that's for Desan. Is it? Yeah, it is. It's definitely for Desan. But I forgot where we drop it off. Here. Is it here? It is. Come on, baby. Dark Elidium? There. Done. Right, what's next? I can't believe it made us give, give us like more mining and collecting quests. And the quest name is just mine more of this. Okay. It was this, wasn't it? No. Gather ingredients. We need to gather more black algae. I'm sure that's... Is that on top of the... Is the black algae... Under... Or was that the stuff that was underwater? It might have been. It might have been the stuff that was underwater. Okay. <laughs> We've got... Less than one HP. <laughs> Look at the health bar. This is it. This is it. Assessing. Creatures are in their element underwater. Return to surface to reduce danger. Oh, look. A shark. That was the first time we've seen a shark. Shark. Oh, crikey. Oh, shit. Hey. Can't kill the sharks. Is 
Fucking shocks, a cockroach, man. I'm only here for the black algae. I don't even know how many I need to collect. We'll just keep collecting them until it's... It If we die, it's fine. Do we just get more health? <laughs> we look, look, we're dead. Man's gonna feast on our corpse. Assessing. Return to surface to reduce danger. Yeah. Return to surface to not get ate by a shark. Land shark. Do we need to collect 20 of these? We've got like three, six, nine, ten. We picked up 11. Oh, who's back, spawned right here. That's perfect. Give me this. Let's keep going then. Assessing. Return to surface to reduce danger. I forgot how we boosted the. Oh, there we go. Bro, I must have collected about 3,000 now. This is where we died. Hey, 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 hey. Wait, hold on. Let me check the quest log. Quest log, black algae. Unless it wants me to deposit it now. This. Gather more black algae. Maybe we do need a lot. This is so, this is so exciting. Said nobody ever. Bro, how many do I need? Bro, shark, I'm not even bothered. Not bothered. Your bite is less painful than the quest in this game. I'm on an island. That's gotta be it. That's gotta be it. I can't, I'm not collecting anymore. Come on, let's go and drop this off. Oh, the only problem is, where do we drop it off though? It's, it's probably in the same place, do you think? Maybe. Who knows? This is it. One more fetch quest after this, and that's it. It's got to be everything done. Done. Right, last one. Where's the last one? Come on, baby. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling great. What does this say? Collect stolen goods. I don't need this. This is the one. We need to gather more bugots. Is that the thing on top of the mountain? I don't even know what a boot got is. <laughs> These quests. What the hell? They're coming for me. Boost, 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 boost! Oh no, I remember what the Bugots are. Oh, these are the plants we have to sneak up on. What an absolute joke. Are you kidding me? We need four more of these. Okay, this isn't too bad. I mean, it's bad. It, it's excruciating. But collecting four, four or three of them now is not that bad. In there, it's got to be the end game. Got to be. Got to be. Last boss. This better be the best last boss we've ever fought, ever. To try and redeem itself. Last one, baby. 
actually we might have a lot of points to spend. Do we have... We've got 285 blue stuff. What can that get us? We could take the... Glide boost consumes less energy. I've got that. Do I have that? I've already bought that. Where's the... Glide boost is now more powerful. 300. We need... Well, we'll probably get enough to get that. After we complete this quest, because we get 15 blue every time we finish a quest, I think. Right, let's go. Heading back to Desa. Absolutely riveting, lads. <laughs> Pardon me, lads. Preser preservative chest. I've just had a massive ice cream. Ice cream. Chocolate ice cream. Lotus Biscoff sauce. In double serving of cookie dough. Bad lad. Right, we're there. Where, where are we going over there? Press the wrong button. Right, come on. This is it. This is it. This is it. This is it. Everything done. Every single fetch quest done. It's got to trigger the main mission. Oh, we only got five blue halidia. Wait there. Don't these guys give us free halidium? Downstairs. It needs to be more than 15. None. Nightmare. We only need 10 blue halidium. That's fine. I'm not even interested. Okay. Everything's max level. We could possibly upgrade the pistol, but it's a complete waste of time. I'll put them on um, on level two. I'm not going to spend 200. Go on then. Five. I'm not going to add anything. What could we add to this to make it better in case we need it? We could give it 80% damage. Level three. Nice. That pistol's much better. Now, we should have done everything. It says there's one more mission here. Gather more incense. Oh my days. Really? That every time we think we're getting somewhere, it just keeps it keeps telling us to collect more shit. It just keeps doing it. It's 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 never ending. This is purgatory. Gather incense. And now what? What was that it? That was... That was it, look. We've only got... What about Kizar? Why is this not done? Something's not right here. There's nothing left to do. Oh, unless it is collect stolen goods. Provide smoke grenades. How do we provide more smoke grenades? Or do you think it's because of this and we've just got to wait a time period for this to happen? Oh, no. Really? Oh. I think... We'll go and find this mystery location. This might be... It might be. It might be something. It might not. I think we've just got to pass time to have this quest finish itself. It's the worst. Uh, the worst. So oh, far with 300 meters. Are you oh. on this frequency? What's the emergency? No emergency, but according to the map, it looks like we're down to one last base that remains inaccessible. This is what we need. Anyway, you can help me with this one? I'm on it. Sorry. 
I've been busy with something else. What have you been sure busy with? Something else? Not now. Soon. I marked the coordinates on your map. That's the base. Be gone by the time you get there. Take care, Commander. Thanks for everything. This is Hope it, lads. On the other side of this. Slay it out. We're collecting these plants just in case we need them. Right, where's the base? It's right. It's well, actually, we're right next to it. Excellent. Here we go. Storm the gates. This should be the hardest base in the game. It'll be easy, but I mean, it should still be the hardest. We've got full health. This is the penultimate base, and we already since we've already scouted this area out, we know there's a boss in there to fight. It's just one of the robot bosses in the reactor or underground in the mining area. Come to daddy. Come to papa. I see ya. Do we have full ammo? Yeah, we've got pretty much full ammo. And didn't we upgrade this gun so that it no longer it only uses one ammo per shot? So we, we've got enough to clear this base out without even having to reload. I like it. Coming in. Yeah, this is gonna hurt. Not seen anybody. I seen someone run down them stairs. Headshot! Missed. Right in the bollocks. He's a big boy. Headshot 544 damage. Get wrecked. Alright, come on, let's stay on the ground level. Kill these things. Beautiful. Yeah. Big fella. Right, we'll take out the little little guys first. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Headshot. Right, I'm gonna get full charge on this guy. Go on, full send. And he's gone. She gone. Whoa. Do a backflip, son. That's a headshot. That is a headshot. Knee cut him. Right, we need to unlock... Ah. Headshot. Two switches over this way. This is where the, the reactor is. Kobe. There's a big fella coming around the corner. Let's see if we can activate this before he gets here. There he is. Headshot. There's another one. Beautiful. Wait there, where's the... Which? So we need two more switches, I think. Hey, 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 hey. Less of that sunshine. Where's big boy? Headshot. 
This guy, watch, he's coming in. That was your last mistake. Just outside. Headshot. Actually, it's inside. How do we get in there? Ah, this corridor. That guy had a fully charged shot waiting for me walking around that corner. Oh, there it is. Right, last one. Last switch. There's more switches than this to open up the, the loot door, but this will get the quest done. <laughs> no, 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 no. Get wrecked. <laughs> this guy's this guy's like he's jumping through a portal when you cast two portals in a portal game and jump through it guy hit terminal velocity and we need to get outside I actually think we're stuck in here aren't we There's got to be a door around here. Get in my pocket. Go. We got him. Headshot. Headshot, baby. Oh, easy. Look at all this loot. I know you're there. Man was hiding behind cover with his head sticking out the top. This is what we need. Actually, two of them. One upstairs, one downstairs. Well, that's enough for the core. That's fine. We can get the reactor anytime we want. But we want the loot. That's the loot door over there. Will somebody there? Headshot. Bro, I can barely see him. He was a pixel. Last. This is the last one. Let's go and get this loot and then we'll go and destroy the core. And this, this is the last base in the game. We've done them all. Hopefully, it's going to let us into the end game. Although, I'm a bit skeptical. Oh, went the wrong way. Can we? We've still only got 290 blue, so we can't. What's in there? All of the loot. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Sit down. It greatly reduces the weapon's recoil. That makes no difference. We're using a one shot gun. <laughs> we don't care about recoil. We could fire this gun, it would make us backflip 360, and it wouldn't make a difference. Okay. Where's the generator? 
Here it is. See ya. If we get 10 blue things, we'll upgrade the jetpack booster for flying. Even though I think we're, we're, we're not really going to need it. Oh, I forgot we got to do the boss. Alright, then that's fine. Did we get... We didn't get any blue for completing that. Wait, where's this boss? Enough white halidium has been brought to Sapper. Talk to Zaleb to start the escort mission to bring the white halidium to Kizar. Right. We'll kill this boss first. It's John Cena. The damage. We can two shot each boss. Come on, I'm fully charged, fully charged, fully charged. Beautiful. Stupid quantum fence. Full send. That was a full send we gun. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, I forgot about this. Last one. Bro, it's dead. It's already dead. <laughs> Get ripped. Now. That's it. No more trolls. I'll take that just in case we need it. Which we do. We got the 15 blue halidium. Okay, we'll get this upgrade. We'll get the... Light boost is more powerful. Done. We could have, lad, look at the combat skills. Oh, the combat. I forgot the combat skills required the purple stuff. We just never needed it. I'm going to make the shield better. Instant shield, no one cares. Increases the melee damage dealt, don't care. Improves armor, reducing damage take. I mean, that probably could be good. This this probably would have came in handy earlier on, but we just you just don't need it. That's too much of a beast. Focus. Dodge an attack or projectile at the last moment to slow down time. Now I'm not interested in that. Charged attack. Hold X to supercharge. This is a hundred. This is two hundred. We still can't get access to that, so we do have to access this. This costs fifty blue before we can get access to this ground pound. That's ridiculous. Well, if, if that's the case, then. How the hell? Why don't we just upgrade the armor? 202. Our guy's a beast. Right, wait, how do we do this escort mission now? Let's save the game in case the game crashes. We know how prone it is to do that. Save over the last slot. Right. Quest. This one. Let's no. Oh, how do we? Oh, is it this Kizar? This one. Ah, I've seen it. I've seen it. This. Escort the white halidium. Come on, baby. Where are we doing it? Sapper. Love a good escort mission. <laughs> Second favorite only to collect, collect missions. Oh, this boost is nice. Enough white lithium has been brought to Sapper. Talk to Zaleb. Hanak. 
you know, merchant. I don't need a merchant. What we could do, actually, since we don't... I might buy an upgrade for our plants. What trip? That was fun. That was fun by now. I want to buy stuff. Talan Beacon Cooldown. And Supply Upgrade, I'd buy that. Portion Supply Upgrade. Greater Portion. Buddha. I don't even know what that is. I'll get this. Where's Zaleb? Zaleb, where are ya? Zaleb, got you, brother. Let me just check one thing. I think, yeah, we're good. We're all good. Zaleb, we're ready. Hey, Zala, I'm here. Yes. Yeah. I'm on a boat, son. Boat your ability. Okay, we're gonna have to be fast here. Let me get right to the front. Already struggling. This is a good spot. I'm getting a fully charged shot already prepared. Ugh, that's not good. That's only these little things. Easy. Is that it? Oh, I forgot we we have to destroy these, don't we? Hope you got parachutes. <laughs> we can one shot on. Right, if we see one of them coming again, we're gonna fly straight away and see if we one shot before we even need to take out the little babies. Here it is, here it is. Oh shit. That didn't go to plan. Oh, oh, it's getting damaged. That's fine. What's a few bullet holes to a bolt? A bolt! What's a few bullet holes to a bolt? Nothing. What's this? Module part. Oh, double trouble. I think it's best if we just wait until it's close to the boat and it stops. We'll jump up, double tap it. Easy. Come on, wait for it. Team Ulukai does it again. Shit, I can't aim. Can't aim, can't aim, can't aim. Oh, 
I think the area of effect is best for this gun because it can kill more things at once. One more, one more. That's what you get. Get wrecked. Piece of piss. Hurry up. Bring the Helidium through the spear before the invaders spot us. Best, trust me. The Almayel will open the spear for us. You did good, Lias. Hold on. I can't believe I'm back in Kizar after all these cycles. Thank you, Ulakai. Anytime, baby. What is a Dalatai guardian doing in Kizar? Her exile is over. We need to band together and face the invaders as one race, united by the Yards. You did this. You brought Sankra to Kizar. I asked him to. The Dalatai guardians will be strong allies. Strong? Strength incites Sankra, and Sankra destroys Melia. Sankra can be controlled. Control is merely another step toward Sankra. You've served well, human. Take this half of Kizar's Daramon as a token Finally. of the Almayel's gratitude. Not that we need it. What do we even need this for? Everybody's on our side now anyway. Receive Daramons. Prove to Yelly you've earned Almas trust by placing the Daramon in Kizar. Right, come on then. Move to yell. Oh shit. This way. Boost! Bro, you can fly so fast now. Oh, we always got the wrong door. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Have it, have it. Take it, take it. Don't care. I don't care for the ceremony. You have gathered. I've seen the same cutscene fifteen times. Talan people and reconciled the Dolatai guardians with the Almayel. Praise the Yards. For you are truly a friend of Adelpha. And I'm glad this is going to be over soon. The Yards have spoken. Me Do too. Do you feel them? They are listening. Kizar shall sing for the survival of Adelpha. Let Augustok begin! Augustok. Let's bring the pain to our enemies. Everybody looks the same. That's the, 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 nobody looks different. You, nobody in this game knows what other characters, apart from this guy, because he's got a beard. Everybody looks the same. Could have all been the same guy for all we know.
What the hell are we watching? This is some PS1 type shit in it. They do what the dancing reminds me of Omicron and Nomad Soul. Bear in mind that game from like 1999. Actually, that makes sense. Isn't this game from 1999 as well? Well, the original. Am I interrupting? Always. I'm joking. Akastok is going well. I feel the joy of my people, even if it's only for a short while. I've just I realized what that. this entire game was. We all deserve a break. Where's Alma? She, we would... She's somewhere. I don't know. We haven't spoken this moon. There's Sankra between us. Ah, Sankra. Always Sankra. We are a glorified party planner. 20 hours of party planner. I ask you a personal question? Ask away, but I might not answer. On this island, a lot of couples are forming, but you're here alone. Yeah. There must be a man. I mean, a, a male. Or maybe a female that you're, I don't know, attracted to. Man's laying it on thick. Have you ever been in love, human? Whoa. I go personal, you go deep. You don't have to answer. No, I, I want to. I just, uh, I don't have the answer. But you have a child. What happened between me and Wolf, oh, Marion? It was a moment. It happened on a mission. We were drawn to each other, and that was great. But back home, uh, it's so hard sometimes to just communicate. We never really got a chance to be together, to really try us out as like a couple. You wanted to? She met someone else uh, before she even knew she was pregnant. And I'm not the type of guy who takes a day off to assemble a crib. So anyway, she's gone. And it feels like a rock in my gut pulling me down. This Marion, why do you call her Wolf? Oh, that was her code name on our first mission together. Supposed to keep things professional, you know? So it was not love. Well, I came to know her better on Adelpha. I wish I would have saved her, but I, I don't know how I felt. It's just the damned guilt again, clouding everything. We didn't have enough time, I guess. She is with Yad Ka now. I sense her essence through your words. Bullshit. You understand exactly how I'm feeling right now, don't you? Sit next to me. Let's feel her essence. Bro, I want to feel some other essence. Bro, we were about to clap some cheeks, and then she started bringing up my dead. Then I started bringing up my dead wife, the absolute mood, actual mood killer. Nephew requested that Morogs are brought over from any. Oh my god, more more delivery requests. Why? This is not. We better not. We better not. We better not. We've got to bring more Mora. Lads, I thought we were past this. Bro, I thought we got into the end game, so we were past collecting shit. The game never lets up, does it? I've never. Lads, I. I, I would do what I'd like to do. I'd like to go through all the what maybe less than twenty probably let's say approximately twenty hours it's gonna take us to finish this. If 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 we can hurry up and finish the game. I'd love to go through my twenty hours of footage and, and count and tally up. Played. I found 
how much of it is nonsense. I'm going to say there's probably two hours worth of actual gameplay in this game. I've been through a lot today, but this hurts the most. Listen up. I located a personal transport. This is your ticket to the orbital portal. But... But, no, there's no but, my friend. The Yods kept their promise. I am going home. Yeah. There's something I should probably tell you, though. Save it for later. Just hit me with the coordinates. Your call, Commander. The personal transport's location should be popping up on your map. We'll talk later. Signing off. Ulakai, I see new coordinates on the map. My guardians are not far from there, but there's a problem. What kind of problem? They spotted multiple invaders hidden around some kind of machine. If this is what you're after, it's obviously a trap. But don't worry. The Dolatai Guardians are going to surprise them. We have powerful weapons now. Don't do anything recklessly, Az. Wait for me. I'm on my way. I'm not waiting. We're moving in. Hurry up, Ulakai, or you'll miss the battle. Lia's out. Lia's. No! God damn it. I better get there fast. I hope she knows what she's doing. <laughs> okay, so we've got a different quest. Nice. Hi. What can you, can what can you give what me? Can... Uh, I thought you were a traitor. You know Bro, are you a traitor or not? What? Do you procreate? What? Emir? Who? Trade? You know? Come. Oh, I support the wrong guy. Hi. It told it, it was give me a conversation with the wrong guy. Z dogs. I don't need the shit. Right. What's the deal? Bring more morags. However, that wasn't what pop. Ah, look. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Reach the transport. Right, here we'll drop these more out. No, we're not. We'll do the transport first. Let's go. Can we fast travel? Nice. Main story quest, baby. What was I saying? Right, so, slay to Liaz. Do you read me? Liaz, please come in. Did anything happen? Oh, this ain't normal. Don't worry, I'm here. Yes, what happened? You inspired us, Ulokai. The Dolatai Guardians are celebrating their first victory against the oppressor. Oh, time. Every village helped us win. I told you to wait for me before using the weapons. Shooting guns is easy. It's like a second nature to me. Almost like it runs in my blood. Slade, your position's compromised. Get out of there now. Who was that? It's no one. We have to run, Lias. Run! We are done running! The Yods have united the Talans behind you, Ulakai. We fight! I took a rocket to the face. That's what she gets. There's too many of them! You have to escape! It's two guys. Mate, I take out full on encampment. Oh, it's the boss battle. It is. Right, let's see how much damage we. I'm not even. I'm just forgetting about these guys. I want to hit this guy in the head with a fully charged shot. I missed the headshot. Right, this guy's getting fully charged. Where's he going? Oh, you can float. <laughs> Kai can float. 548 damage. <laughs> Come on, baby. Five hundred and sixty two on a fully charged headshot. Bro, you are pathetic. This guy's getting a full one. I watched this. <laughs> oh, made him do a backflip. This is 
is insane! They just keep coming! Run! No! Don't do this! I'm human too, see? Drop your weapon! Slade, do as he says. Trust me, I'll protect you. I wouldn't trust him. You? You're one of them? Yes. I mean, no, no, I'm not. I'll, I'll explain. Commander Slade? It's... I've seen you. You don't even remember me. How about this? You gave it to me 20 years ago. Wait, what? Oh my god! Camilla? Neilapta! <laughs> No! Left to Lias! You know say Atar! You really speak their language. Baby girl, I can't believe I've been gone 20 freaking years. You haven't aged a single day. How's that possible? Listen to me. It doesn't matter. Daddy's back for you. Just like I promised. The alien stole my necklace. We need to catch her. We need the necklace, baby. here, and that necklace is part of her religion. Do you have any idea of its value to me and the whole human race? Hey, relax. There's plenty of these glowing stones around. I'll, I'll get you another one. So you have access to the source of the quantum crystals? Quantum what? You mean Halidium? That stone is the most powerful source of energy ever discovered by mankind. Not by mankind, by the Talans. And it was just a present, not a free pass to steal all of the Talans' resources. And you chose these Talans over your people. Is oh them... my god, woman, are you brain dead? I tried to save everyone. And what did I get in return? Death penalty. You got my mother killed. Than half the population of Earth. That's why they executed you. Please don't listen to Jack's lies. Your heart knows the truth. I know it does. I'm your father. Bro, she needs a sharp show you an uppercut. You too, baby girl. And I'm sorry, Daddy. You're under arrest. But you couldn't, bro. There's no, there's no, no way. Uh, Camilla, listen. Bro, man. There's no way she could have arrested me. This, lads, I, I do think if you, if you, lads, if you get st sucked through into another dimension and time passes really slowly for you, and then you meet your daughter maybe two months later, but 20 years has passed and she's grown up into an adult and she's an absolute cockroach. You should have full autonomy, but you shoot her in the face. No longer your daughter. It's just somebody that you used to know. Look what they're doing. Burning my peoples. Oh, it's the ore guy. Is this the guy that hunts fish with an ore? That's on the cutscene so bad. I'm not armed. Please. Killer. I know you understand me. Shoot her in the face is a nightmare. It's an absolute nightmare. She's just where where am I locked up in some sort of dungeon? Camilla. Um tell yes, I'm sorry. Oh. 
Don't be sorry. Raising an orphan by yourself can be tough, but so rewarding. Camilla graduated first of her class. Never missed a single one of my birthdays. Such a my good My daughter! Girl. I need to talk to her! Your daughter? I adopted Camilla, comforted her, and taught her everything she knows. What did you do? Look, I didn't kill Marion. Camilla is all I have left of her mother. We were about to get married. That mission, you and these miserable aliens ruined my life. What kind of general is willing to exterminate a whole race for his personal grudge? Good thing that Camilla doesn't have your genes. She sees a different way. That's why she put you in shackles. My day dayo tour ne carafafur. And you learn their language, that's so sweet. And I need a translator. Yeah, dream on, I'd rather die. Again. Help me interrogate the prisoners. And seize the source of quantum crystals. Or I start shooting their leaders one by one. We have a code magenta situation, sir. Camilla. What did Camilla do this time? She went after the aliens to negotiate, and... It's not clear what happened, sir, but... Spit it out! She went AWOL. HQ lost her signal. They think the aliens got her. Show me her last position on the thermal grid. Now. She was under your surveillance. I'm sorry, General. I saw Camilla going straight to Lias. Shit. I gotta get out of here. Commander Slade. My friend. It's you, is it? The voice in my ear. Oh, shit. Commander Slade, I am Colonel Vernon, the major that recruited you 20 years ago. Sending you to Adelpha was a suicide mission, and I'm sorry. Water under the bridge. Doesn't matter anymore. You're gonna bail me out. I don't have the code to your cell. Yes, you do. Shoot me. Have you lost your mind? We'll meet again. Trust me. I can't believe I'm doing this. I hope you know what you're doing, soldier. Well, for the first time in moons, I think I do, my friend. Now I just need to get out of here. And yes, we Noah. do. Stop crying. It only makes you look weak. They say Dad Can we shoot something yet? Didn't want me die because of him. Nothing hurts more than the truth, Camilla. I hate them. Hush now. It's okay. I'm here. I'm gonna talk to those boys. They're the ones who are gonna be sorry. Trust me. Oh, it's so boring. Your necklace can help a lot of people, Camilla. Don't you want to save the world? All right. You can have it. But only for a little bit, okay? I promise. My friends just want to have a quick look at it in their lab. Right, right, okay. We'll, let, let's look at it in the lab. We don't care. Lads, this is the past. The vortex left humanity with almost no resources. Come on, say it. So this game is a game that just dangles the carrot in front of you for 15 hours straight, making you think you want to actually get to a mission. And you never get there. You never, ever get to a mission. I thought we were going to have some sort of fight here. We got... A, we got 15 mini cutscenes that said nothing. Oh, and another one. Great. Stay where you are. Uh, hey, it's me. He's alone. Should I press the trigger? I don't know. I've never done this before. Trust me, pal. You don't want to start today. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. What are you doing? You hurt the ass. No surrender. 
the Galenter is throwing Mordax at us again. Let's get out of here! Where's Doc? And what's with the makeup? Doc is gone. Since the humans took all the chiefs, we, on Sankras, are leading the uprising. United behind Lias, Talans will fight back! But not this moon. It's on Sankras. Oh boy. I got a bad feeling about this. Me too. To the rescue. New main quest unlocked. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh fuck me. No, please. Save all the village leaders from the WFA. Oh, this is going to be absolutely devastating. This is going to be absolutely devastating. Talk to villagers to get leads on where they are. More talking, more fetch quests. More. How do you know? But have you returned? Tell us where he is. Yeah, the witch. Catch you. Reach the personal transport. That was a... Liaz, it's me. Do you copy? Talk to me, please. I'm sorry, Liaz. Doc, so I made a pill. Yeah, this is... Citizen... No, nobody, nobody gets it. What? You don't... Where? I don't... Doc, I got... Ah, uh, and... <sighs> we, we, lads... I didn't finish, so... I was saying, I'm sorry. Let's then, speak to I'm everyone sorry. until we find the I'm person sorry. that knows where he is. Can you? Do you know? Uh, good. Take. <laughs> sorry, we got interrupted. Where was I? Ah, yes. I'm sorry, Liaz. Please don't hurt my daughter. <laughs> hey, no. Not. I'm going to break out, Doc. Asan's protectors are watching, human. I'm not allowed to sell it. Come on, Z If I don't want... There's... Hey, as... What? I need... My protectors have identified his position. Where? I can show you where they are detaining him. Then what are you waiting for? The invaders had us surrounded. Doc. Weak. Whatever. Ah, uh, no. If. On. Let's. Right. So we found out where he was. Excellent. He's been taken hostage by the WFA over there. Bro, this is the same base. This is the same base, isn't it? I Colonel. bet you. Slate to Colonel Vernon. That's you the read. same Slate. base that we've already Slate. taken out. Oh, I cannot Lord. wait. I'm sorry. Look, time works differently when I cross the other side. Any news from Camilla? The Talan still have Let, her, We need to see this. If you manage to make your rebellious friend talk, I can track her This is going to make us do the same base as we've already done I'm over and over sure again. Yes, it's still my friend. More rehashed, reused dog I'll see shit. What I can do. Slate out. Jesus. It might not, but it might. Or maybe not. I am onto Galanta's head and right here. Something weirdly, as I haven't been hungry or thirsty since setting foot here. And that's not normal, is it? I mean, you tell us eat and drink, right? The have to ride of Talan cuisine used to be Reese. He's flying away. And it still is for many poor people because it's so cheap to cultivate. What are you doing? You will find many Reese fields between Bita and Emiya. The people of Emiya will tell you the taste of Reese doesn't compare to Morat. What is she doing? And I must agree with them. In Sapa, they prefer to eat Senecta. 
But that's because they don't have access to anything other than fish, which is still more than Disan has. They used to import food from other regions, but haven't been able to since the Daokas went down. Bro, what about drinks? I'd Bro, it's, it's, it's flying away. I hate this game. I hate everything. I hate everything in the game. There's nothing good. Why is my creature flying away from me when I need it for the quest? Okay, we'll do, lads. Let's just save it here. And they give me head of wobble. Jesus, I thought we were. I thought we were actually in the end game. We're just being presented with more fetch quests. See you in the next one, lads. Lads, on stream, we're taking a five minute break. Actually, are we taking a five minute break? Yes, yes. I definitely. I'm going to take a five minute break. I need it. I need it. I need to clear my head. <laughs> Get a drink. Be back in five, lads.
All right, lads, we are back. More fetch quests. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. I can't hold my excitement. Simply can't hold it in. Right. Looks like we're going to have to do the same quest six times. We're going to have to go to each village. We're going to have to talk to everybody with an exclamation mark over their head so we can find where the person, where the next person is. How pathetic. How absolutely pathetic. And I wouldn't be surprised if every single rescue quest here is the same mission. But I guess we'll find out. But I guess we will see. Okay. Let's get into a position of maximum comfort. Which we are nearly there, are we? Yeah, boy. Okay, we'll try that one again. No idea why my Galena was running away from me. Okay. Well, I don't know what the odds. Right, now we're on me, it. I don't feel the need to put anything into me, so nothing. Free comes. duck. Oh, so apparently, to free duck, we have to stay on this thing because I find that we Talons have a seventh sense that filters out too much unnecessary information. Ulakai. Um. Sure. Got it. That's so weird. Right, back in action. We have to stay on this. Free that. Get to the location on the mini map. Eh? So climb onto the Galena's head and ride her. Bro, what? I'm on. What? Bro, what even is this quest? I'm riding. I can't ride this ah, thing any hard. Me. Oh. Right. Bro, this game is so shit. <laughs> now it's telling me to get on her head. <laughs> what? What is this quest? Bro, I, I can't be any further on top of. I can't be any closer to the map marker if I tried. Jeremy, brother. Jeremy. I. I've. Completionist. That is right. That is right. I've got. But I've got some bad news, Jeremy. I figured out how to get around that right the other day when we when we left the stream. I figured out how to to make the quest progress. Jeremy, I actually can't help myself. There's unfinished jobs in this crap game. Have to finish them. I know, Jeremy. Let me let me just spell it out. After we ended the stream the other day, I was like, it, it was doing my head in. Do you know what? Do you know what was? It wasn't bugged. Do you know what it was? We had to. You were actually right. I remember you saying, do you not need to fill the bars up fully? You were right. But... On previous ones that we had completed the fetch quests for, a new quest appeared, even though there was a tick next to it, saying, collect more. And that word more was, was the difference. I just thought we'd already completed that, co collect more. So we collected them all for all the villages again. Every single quest identical, not even in different locations, in the same location that we did the first time. Collected loads of shit. And then we now we progressed the game. So do now, Jeremy, do you want to know what's happened now? What are we now? Watch this. All of the villagers have been captured, right? All of the villagers' leaders have been captured. We've got to go and rescue them all. Every single quest the same. We go there. We speak to everybody with an exclamation mark on their head until they tell us where they are. Then we go there. But now we're stuck. Jeremy, now this quest... Oh! Now 
Now the fucking menu's broke again. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremy, there, there is a reason why I need to do this though. So I'm so close to end, I have to finish it. I, I think I've got I've got issues, right? But I've got Dragon's Dogma ready to install. I can't have them installed at the same time because there's not enough room on the hard drive. So I did, yeah, Jeremy. I got the last two enemy bases done too. I did them. So we, I did the bit that I didn't know how to do. Figured it out. Did more collect missions. The two last bases popped up. I've taken them out. We've now... The, the aliens have celebrated and the humans have come and captured them all. And that's where we are now. And that's where we are now. And I can't do this quest because the quest says go to the location. I go to the location and it says climb aboard your big space flying alien and go to the location. So we climb on the big space flying alien and it says go to the quest marker in an infinite endless loop of non-progress. Look, we get to the location on the minimap. Right, I'm I'm there. Is it is it fixed? I'm here. The Dax not here. Do you think he's He's not like in a cave, is he? Oh my god, that I just wanna finish I just wanna finish the game. I just want to finish the game. The guy's not here. Free Dak, climb onto the Galenta's head and ride her. Now the quest bugged again. Look. Get the location on the minimap. I'm here. I can't fly any lower. If you get to the credits, you'll have the only complete place I want. And uh, Jeremy, this has got to be a. a A world first. <laughs> Climb onto the Glinda's head and ride her. Draw the gate. I can't do this quest. The game's broke. Right, I give up. I give up. Let's let's try somewhere else. <laughs> Jeremy, bro. Bro, I don't even know why I do this to myself. Anyways, let's be positive. Jeremy, I went out this morning on a, on a two hour long bike ride. I feel fantastic. Afterwards, because we're in the healthy mindset, me and my last went and got a big chocolate ice cream. <laughs> it was amazing. Anyways, brother, how's your day? How's your weekend going, Jeremy? The WFA grabbed Huron. Someone must have seen where they took him. All right, let, let's, let's talk to everyone so they can tell us where the next person is. March, I'm Mars, you're I, I don't know. Well, this you know where the imprisoned leader is. I, I don't know. See. He doesn't. Let's let's just ex let's get rid of his whole dialogue hey, just in case you never know. You know, the whole I'm what he is what is on. You can I see right. Any more? <laughs> right on. You build a new climbing structure for the doggy daycare. I take my dog to. They opened 
a new big yard and they need something to do in it. Oh, that's amazing, Jeremy. Hi there. Yeah. Are you making it quite big? The funny thing is, you know what's funny about a doggy structure is we've got um, a couple of neighbours down from us have got two of those massive dogs with the blue eyes. You know the dogs that look like wolves and they've got really bright blue eyes? They've got a climbing frame in the back garden for the dogs. I think it's awesome. What about... Give me... This a miracle. Um, what? Your kind might be... I'm... Do... Do you have a human? I'll... Take... I'm not... Okay, so he doesn't know where... Where the guy is. Bro. This talk... Can... Marzo. Marza. Now he might, this guy might know. Hey, Mark, that. You were. It's. No, I'm. What? It's bad. Okay. I. If it's. I. Hey, right, okay, this guy's actually taking us on a mission. Get in there. Ooh, 16 by 8. Well, that's quite a size. Stinky. It's a bunch it of four foot square long. blocks at different Whatever heights happens, with ramps. What a banger. Quiet, okay? Got it. Let's awesome. go. Awesome. J Jeremy, I'm, I'm, do you know I've got the? So, anyways, as I was saying, I'm trying to finish this game so I can install Dragon's Dogma. Uh, I've, I'm actually a bit embarrassed, bro. I've spent so much time in the character creator. I, uh, my character was dead easy. I just used like some of the default presets and whacked a beard on it, and and that was it. My guy's made, bro. David Bowie. David Bowie's looking good. I might have spent, I might have spent, over the course of like a few different sessions here and there. I think I've made David Bowie. I think he looks amazing. Because, <laughs> what are we doing? Where, where are we actually headed? This isn't even, this isn't even the quest. Oh, there. Free Huron. That should have been posted as a bonus episode. Jeremy, it, the character creator is quite good. It took me a while. I was just chilling. I was watching st stuff on the on the PC, but I was just chilling, creating David Bowie. Um, but uh, Jeremy, I'll show you. If, if you're still, I don't know how long it's going to take us to finish this game. I don't actually think we can because that other quest seems bugged. But um, I might give you a <laughs> before we knock off today. I give you a sneak peek. It's not great, lads. I'm probably I'm probably oh, hyping it up good. a lot more than it needs to be, but I'm mighty impressed with it because when we played Dragon's Dogma the first time, the, well, the original game, Dragon's Dogma One, and we made David Bowie, we literally just made some random guy with grey hair, right, like looking like the guy from Labyrinth. But I think he actually looks like David Bowie a bit. If you like squint your eyes until your eyes are pretty much shut, and then think about David Bowie, he looks the same. As well, Jeremy, I'll tell you something. I feel like I'm gonna pass out. Why is my shield not working? Oh, the boss is there. I didn't realize he was the boss. Yeah, Jeremy, every one of these quests has us fighting this same boss over and over again. No, no changes whatsoever. Every quest from here on out, this is copy and paste. Man's killed us, that's fine. Every single quest is puts us in a in a in a crystal maze dome, has us fight enemies with the same boss. No difference. Copy and paste, straight up. Maybe that no dome is supposed to appear for the other this. guy. That's my, we might be missing a cutscene. Yeah, that's fine. Ah oh, shit! They captured Huron. They're taking him somewhere. I gotta stop them. I 
And that's it. Just the boss left. Five hundred and seven damage, baby. How does that hit the lads? How does that hit me? Just what I needed. That's actually <laughs> got him as he was invisible. Five hundred twenty-eight. Got him. I hit him with a headshot there. You're dead. See ya. Whoa, you smell like a barrel of rotten beer. <laughs> the direct center of my face. The smell of lab bay. Here on, you're safe. Run as fast as you can back to Bida. Now! Not much longer. How shit are these sound effects? My appetite. Sucker. Tad, did you hear that? Did you hear the audio quality there? Okay, so we managed to free him. There, there's one down another 54 to go. Fantastic. Right, we'll do. Thing is, I'm a bit worried. We could go to all these quests and do this. Although this has appeared now. A Galenta can lead you to his location. A Galenta can. We'll try it again. Envy, brother! Can't wait for the Dragon's Dogma 2 stream. It's Monday. We're, it's going to be amazing. And... Lias, we've taken down a new outpost in the... No one cares. No one cares. Right. The sound of Mix in person was on break. <laughs> that Purpose took over. The good it soldier was. is to end wars, Lias, not start them. Right. So, Don't what we've seen about Dragon's Dogma there is... It's not going to end well. When I was making my character in the character creator, the free one you can download before you bought the game. That's where we've we've built our characters in. Um, I haven't I haven't actually installed Dragon's Dogma 2 yet. I'm waiting to finish this game so we can uninstall this so I've got room to put Dragon's Dogma 2 on. But I've come to a discovery which is a bit It's a bit weird. It's a weird design choice. But I wanted to play Archer. Sweet I wanna I wanna me? play Magic Archer. Oh, yeah. I wish these guys would shut up. I want to play Magic Archer. They've changed the Archer class in Dragon's Dogma 2, which is throwing a curveball because I don't think I want to do it anymore. In Dragon's Dogma 1, you could be in archery class and you had access to the bow and you still had access to daggers because I do like melee, melee combat. All archers have had daggers removed. You've only got the bow for combat. I don't like the regular archer. Because back, back, back in the day, when I played Dragon's Dogma for the first time, I played a regular archer all the way through, and it wasn't very good. I mainly used the daggers. So the fact that you had daggers removed from the archer class, I don't really want to play it anymore. We might still play Magic Archer, but I think we have to unlock that we don't have access to that from the start. Um, Did you find Camilla? Not yet. So I might go thief I instead. I might just go daggers until we get access to the magic tough. archer. The we'll see. It. He we'll won't see. hesitate to execute the prisoners if they don't talk. This is madness. What can we do? What Camilla wanted to do this whole time. Negotiate. You gotta reach out to Earth Command and ask for a truce. Truce? The Talans are attacking our outposts, holding our only negotiator captive. If that's not declaring war, I don't know what is. I know. There's got to be a way out of this mess. I'll give it a shot, but Jack is breathing down my neck. I have zero visibility on the prisoners' locations. Keep me posted. I'll poke around the villages, see if I can find the other chiefs myself before it's too late. Slay it out. How could I get to the location on the minimap when I jump off this and it says, climb up the Galena's head to ride her? Unless they could just... Liaz. Liaz, I 
know you're getting this. Talk to me. What do you want? Listen. Recreators arming the Talons was a bad idea. I know it was my idea, but I made a mistake, and it was... Humans have enslaved Bye. us with powerful weapons. The same weapons that reverted Yan. Now we have them too. The Frida. Zonsakers have more power than ever. Come on. No, don't... <laughs> Where don't is he? Foolishly, yes. Let Camilla go. She shouldn't be part of this. She is the true Ulakai. She who holds the Zokram amulet. The Yod shall save us from the tyranny of your people. The Ulakai will join our fight. Even if How I to find Dak. Leah's out. No. Tell me, because the quest wait. is dog shit. This is not good. This is not good at all. Bro, this this videos for how to find him at the start of the game. Nobody knows this. You had to go okay, fight thanks. that what do I need boss to do? fight to trigger the dialogue here. I, I know. I don't. Jeremy, I don't know where Dak is. I, I wonder if you could. It's weird because look, it says it's it says he's here. But I don't think he is. I Jim think that. I hate these things. I think that's a red heron. Then again, no. You must. Obviously, this beast can smell dark. And he's. It says he's exactly there when we ride this thing. Exactly there. Yeah, he's not here. It said more about it on the map screen. Let me have a look. Dak's been taken hostage by the WFA. While Azan and the other hunters couldn't reach Dak's prison, Azan believed the Galenta can lead you to his location. Oh. I forgot. Lads. Accessing the menu while riding the beast causes the game causes the game to bug. This is this is beyond a joke. It's beyond a joke, lads. We need to finish this game. Dark prison location outcast. Is this the quest that we need? No, nobody's done this. Nobody's done this. There's no information for this online. Show, show me. Show me. What are you supposed to do? I just, I don't get it. Unless it's underground. I mean, I did consider it being underground, but when there's an, a specific map marker that points you to nowhere, it makes you have, an, it makes you second guess. You know what I mean? There's no... Entrances or anything here, is there? Oh, no way. Bro, there's a cave here. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord, there was a cave. What absolute nonsense. Fucking hell. Look, there's a cave with nothing in it. That's how exciting is this. We're running through this cave with nothing in it. When have we ever needed to come into a cave? In oh, great. Not good. Oh, we're gonna kill all these. Watch this, lads. We're gonna break the game. We're gonna break the game. Watch, watch the frame rate. Watch the frame rate. Wait there. Watch this frame rate.
It won't work. I'm not allowed to use this. Oh no, it's working. Look, look at the frame rate. I unleashed the the locusts. Go on, kill them, kill them, kill them. Doc, you're all right. You can come out. My friend, I thought you'd never come back. <sighs> Story of my life. What happened? My here? daughter. She saved me. I've been hiding here since. How is Amia? Fanatics took over the village. The Zon Sankris. I heard Liaz is leading them. I miss the Dalatai Guardians. This new order is far too radical. A danger to us all. Uh, the fight has to stop, Doc. Oh, Jeremy, you Twilight found a walkthrough for this part of the game, but I've already found the cave. <laughs> Jeremy, cheers for that. The time comes. I Maybe appreciate you wingmanning for me there, because I would I was so close to needing that information. I just I never expected to be a cave there. Right, that, that, we've done it, we've done it, come on. Full steam ahead. Who's next? Sapper. Let's go to Sapper. Do their quest. So you know the drill. Talk to everybody in the village again. Can't make an omelette without breaking a few eggs. Are you serious, General? Uh, what I mean is, no one broke him out. I let the prisoner escape. He could lead us to my daughter. Are we still focusing on the source of quantum crystals under that island? Yes, they call it Kizar. I found an interpreter. It's a matter of hours before the prisoners tell me what I need to know. The Directorate should have received your psych eval. The disappearance of your daughter has taken a toll on your- I'm almost there. I'm sure you understand I've been extremely busy with our latest breakthrough. I haven't had time to sit with the military psychologist yet. We're expecting more than your omelette strategy, considering that the fate of humanity is at stake. As I said, I'm almost there. You mean we, we're almost there. Bore him out. These cutscenes are dog shit, aren't they? Irrelevant. Why is any of that relevant to what we're doing? It, it doesn't add anything. This game successfully managed to add loads of cutscenes into the game that just add nothing. Except this massive load screen. Jack is dragging everyone into his personal revenge. I can't let this happen. Kobe. Oh, baby. You and I here. I'm your lead. I'm not talking. Where's the Where's the boss? What about and now? Where's the boss? Tell, ask, what? You, there, what? Sala, this new it. Right, you don't know where the boss is. Who does? <laughs> this guy knows where the boss is. Can I? I've got a good feeling about it. I know I'm filled with terror. Seeing these evil bosses plotting their horrifying schemes, they must be stopped. Exact thing is though, we didn't we fight that guy ages ago, and it was like, do you know the boss battle I've just said? We've we've had copy pasted boss battles the last three times we fought something in a dome. The first time we fought that old guy, he was um, he was that same boss. Zon Sankras. That's what they call themselves, Colonel. The Zon He's not terrifying at all. Out this. Hey, come on, baby. Where's the leader? I hope it's how I call. Uh, can can you pack? Oh, we got it. Free Tanak, the leader of the Sapper, has been imprisoned by the WFA. Show me where it is. Down there. Fantastic. But now that we've selected it, we can fast travel. This is just where we weren't we just here. You had shot him three times and he ran away sobbing. That's right. I remember that. That's right. Sorry. What were you saying? The Zon Sankris hijacked one of our convoys. Heavy casualties. They stole our weapons and quantum resources. Damn. They're going to use those weapons against you. It won't be long before Jack calls for the heavy artillery. You mean there's a heavier artillery? 
Jeez. Have you reached out to Earth Command yet? I'm trying, but the Directorate only has a direct line to the General. No one else. I'll get back to you soon. Good luck. Slate out. Right, we're here. <laughs> we might as well stop and get some healing plants while we're... No doubt this is going to be a dome, a biodome that we have to fight in. The Thunderdome! Yeah, so, as well... Well, I'm about to talk, but then we're probably going to get dragged into a cutscene here, aren't we? Oh, look at this. This is new. Okay, that's consider me impressed. This is new. Yeah, so Dragon's Dogma, as I was saying, we're probably not going to choose Archer because they've lost the ability to use the daggers. And that means the ability to John Cena people off the top ropes is not available for archers. And that massively impacts my fun. If I can't jump off high ledges and five star frog splash people, it's not the class for me. So we're probably going to go with the, the dagger until we unlock magic archer, which could be any, I don't know. I don't know how we're going to do that. We'll probably find out in game. Headshot. Oh, come on. Headshot. Why are you running? How you like that? <laughs> See ya. Right, so... There's another guy there. Right between the eyes. Right between the eyes. Switches. This door's locked, isn't it? Yeah, there's two switches. Is this locked? Shit, everything's locked. We'll have to go underneath. Underneath first. Headshot! Switch. There it is. Oh, hold on. That's that's not even leading us to the switch. This is. Ah, there's the, there's the reactor. Okay, so we've got some sort of underground evil base here. Quite nice. Punk brother, how's it going? A weekend stream, a nice treat. Well, apart from being this game, true punk true. Like, after we finished, I was just saying to Jeremy and Envy, after we finished last stream, I just, I ran about the world trying to figure out how, how we could progress what I thought was bugged. Turns out the game, the game wasn't bugged. No, 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 lads. It was even worse than being a game breaking bug. We had to go to every village we'd ever been to previously in every single fetch quest that we'd already done for them we had to do it again not even in a new location we had to do the same exact same area exact, exact same collect thing it would, to collect more resources so we could progress the game that's how we had that's how we had to progress unbelievable Unbelievable, punk. I couldn't believe it. But I need to get this finished. We're so close to the end. I'm, I'm too determined. And then we can delete this off the system and install Dragon's Dogma. How do we get to there? We came through here. Yes, we could just go. Did we? Yeah, we've unlocked this. Hello? Anyone in here? Which there? We'll go through this way. 
Oh shit! Oh, not gonna lie, this is quite cool. Reminds me of iRobot. Yeah, it's, lads. This is Not this is cool. This. Why is it the first time we're ever doing something like this? Yes. Sounds like utter dog shit. <laughs> What's this? Utter dog shit. I couldn't have said it better myself. It's more like why. <laughs> Why robot? <laughs> it is. This is why robot. Jesus, is this taking us to the? If we can get upstairs. Bro, this guy keeps punching us. Lads, I was trying to aim at that guy and my crosshair was gone. I was like, what's going on? Is it my controller? There was a guy stood in front of us stabbing us in the bollocks. <laughs> at this point, they were throwing in every unused idea they had to get the game done. The thing is though, this, this base is quite cool. Underground evil base, nice. Why didn't we have anything like this, like, in the first 16 hours of the game, when we were just having to talk to people over and over again? Also, I'm not really impressed with how every single base is. Run around, press four of them, and, and destroy the reactor. Like, they couldn't have, they couldn't have thought of something different. Okay. This door's now open. Ah, look, we can get to that switch, I think. Kobe! This guy's just... This guy's physics were next level. Wait there, we're going down. I need to be going up, though. Back in here. Now this big door's open. Okay, okay, we're in, we're in. Yeah, this is gonna hurt. Right, we need a full charge on this guy. It's a whopper! I missed. That'll do. One more, one more. Oh, he's inside. Say <laughs> yeah. I love fighting the same two enemies over and over and over again. There it is. I knew it. I knew it. As soon as I stepped now, I was like, one of these guys is going to be real. Sit down. Two more. Oh, lads, crack shot. Crack shot, baby. 
Would you design different bases for all your minions or just make them all the same and put the focus on your evil lair? This game is too real, that's the problem. True, that's realism. We're not giving this game credit for its realism. Alright, we've done that. Are we supposed to be letting this guy out? We need one more door. Oh, it's all the way down. I've just seen it. Downstairs. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me. You cockroach, mine. Bro, I'm just trying to press the switch. Oh, damn. Bro. Oh, it's got laser beams and shit. Dead. Right, let's stop, stop, stop. I don't know why those things are infinitely spawning. I just don't get it. I don't get the, the logic behind it. Some sort of like base defenses or something. Nanobots. Right, we've done it. So we should be going and rescue that guy in the prison. Base done. Hey, you've been rescued, bro. Done. Free Tanak. Next. Who's next? Desan. Oh, no, we'll go to Palana. Nobody at Procarina. Weird. dialogue that these guys don't even have voices <laughs> oh, that cutscene lads do does anyone care not me this face could not well care played, less played colonel no doubts we'll have more chances with a diplomat like you as a peace ambassador i'm gonna have to shoot him oh, but where's your leader you're me first pilgrim glad does and he doesn't know where the leader is. Oh, this area is quite big. Could be a problem. QA seriously stopped after the first hour. They did. QA did not care. Just didn't care. Oh, look, he actually told us where they were. That way. Right, directly north. Come on, baby. This is quite far away. We might need the Galena. Colonel, you there? Just about to call you. I spoke with Earth Command back home. I was wondering, Earth Command, is that the president or... We lost he... the last POTUS when Air Force One flew into a massive vortex 20 years ago. That's when the seven states that were still united after the dimensional rift reached the core of the Earth fell apart. I thought you remembered that. I only seem to remember the bad stuff. Anyway... I went behind Jack's back to see if the directorate were amenable to a truce. Jack is obsessed with his personal grudge. Did this directorate agree to negotiate? A peace conference will be possible as long as you manage to gather enough to land ambassadors. Easy. When and where is this happening? I'll get back to you with details. Jack knows nothing about this. He's still threatening to execute the chiefs. Uh, not the most engaging peace gesture toward Liaz and the Zonsankras. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Boost! <sighs> Lovely. Do we gotta press more switches here? Of course we do. Of course we do. More switches, you say, sir? Right on it. If you don't know, I am awesome at pressing switches. Look at this. Look at the quality of this. 
more switches. Sounds like the game is building up to one massive mega talk as the finale. Do you know what it is, Jeremy? I know we've took the piss out of the game for the last 16 hours of how much talk it's making us do. But while I appreciate running around here shooting things, at this point it feels a bit uninspired. And I've got the... Um, what's that syndrome? What's that syndrome when you you enjoy being in prison? I've got syndrome where I'm actually missing the talking. I'm missing the talking a little bit. Because <laughs> there's nothing... I'm 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 a bit bored of pressing switches. Oh, we're flying straight through. We are following this yellow line to the next switch. That guy was trying to charge up and do his power attack shot him in the face. What you get, son? Oh shit. Alright, alright. Right between the eyes. Bro, I am the tunnel dweller. This is some Star Wars Shadows of the Empire level design, isn't it? This is N64 caliber. That's a headshot. That is a headshot. Why are you running? Right, where's the switch? This way. With some big ass base. Oh no, look, it goes down another three level. There's a switch over there. Straight through the doorway, look at that, like a rat of a drain pipe. So I was saying, uh, not the most engaging piece gesture toward Lee as in the Right, I feel like I'm the rocketeer. I still got work to do then. Hey, 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 hey. I made those guys part of the scenery. Stockholm Syndrome, that's it, Jeremy. Jeremy, I've got this game's gave me Stockholm Syndrome. It's a good thing they gave you that Batman vision. True. If we didn't have Batman. Oh, do we? Can we still do this? Wait there. I want to show you something. Oh no, he's making a bubble for those guys. Dead. A lot of guys in here. Right between the eyes. Between the eyes. But hold on. Now that we've done that, we've got access through this door. Come on, baby. Need that. Bro, I'm just storming the gates. Give me this. Oh, I know. This machinery keeps the beer cold. Lots of guys gone. This is the be this is the brewery. This has got like 1786 finest malt. Alien malt. There's more. Well, there's the... Oh, destroy the generator. We've done it. We've done it. 
Boom. Kobe. Nice. I thought we have to find the guy. The guy's probably gonna be here. chest in here lots of chests okay i'm about the loot even though we're never going to need anything that we find from these chests because my guy is too much of a beast let's open this i still enjoy loot lads when we start dragon's dogma on monday do you know what's beautiful about starting it you start with nothing the whole world is our lobster we can go around loot kill things john cena off the top ropes when we find a massive creature and we scale, climb the closest rock and then just launch ourselves from it and destroy this monster, it's going to be a feeling like no other. I can't wait. I can't wait. Monday. I've never been as excited for a Monday in my life. Go on here. Oh, this is it. Cutscene, baby. They don't care about drinking joints. They want to know how they can access Kizar. But it's not a drinking place. It's my name, you damn it. I don't even drink, you <laughs> idiot. I told you, Rambar, your name is confusing. At least to us humans it is. You asked Mar to interrogate the Jeeps, but none of them know anything about how to break through the spear and enter Kizar. Mar, it's me, and I'm not with them. Me? Nice to meet you, me. I'm Mar. Humans all look the same to that imbecile. Well, I'm the human who is releasing you from jail, Rambar. All you have to do is follow the essence fine outside back to Polana. You don't want Mar to interrogate the prisoner anymore? No. Mar, I need you to head back to Progriana. Matter of fact, I'll tag along so I can refresh your memory along the way. No. You have memories of Mar? But no. Mar! No thanks. We have to ex escort this guy. So, so we got two, we got two village elders there nice. because we even said, "Where's the guy from Procriana?" We got them both. That's last one. Could this be the? Could this be? I don't really want to get my hopes up because I'm a bit scared. Could this be the last one we need to do before we get to the end game? I've been trying to get to the end game for the last sixteen hours, and May it's just been out of reach. You, and welcome to the Zon Sankras. These guys are dweebs. <laughs> they are, they are, these guys are dweebs. It's ages since I've heard that word. That was like a big word in like the 80s, 90s, wasn't it? Dweebs. I know where she is. I know where that big plant is. The assault will be soon. When the time comes, I will call for your support, Chief. Is everything all right, Ulukai? You look confused. The vine. It showed me all the legends about Adelpha, my father, and my mother. Everything you told me is true. Mind blown, eh? So next time, don't be cheeky to your dad. Yeah, I don't know if you missed this, guys, but we 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 met her in the game. It's my Trust daughter. Division. But like, we haven't aged over twenty years because we ended up in this realm. She has aged, and she was a right little bitch to us. She was nasty, nasty. It's Camilla. It, it was uncalled for. Your mother was a hero, and I did all I could to save her. <laughs> But now she's become enlightened. But guess what? Child support stopped. You get one chance of one chance only, baby, and she blew. Right. Do you need Lacan, to tell me where the boss is? Okay? Just out the hell of. Oh no, he just does race training. That, that's. that's Slade. Come in. Drow. Um, uh, Yard. Uh, he's gone, man. What? He's gone, man. Where's he gone? You don't know. 
I'll find somebody else to talk to. Don't worry. Got cut off. Go oh, ahead. Slate. Vernon to Slate. Come in. Colonel. Ready to turn your underwear into a white flag? You always crack jokes in the worst situations. Ready to hear the conditions for the truce? You all. The rep. Hey, Dutt. Come on. You're the yard. Leader? I've where is he? We found out where the leader was. He's right here. Let's go. I cut you off earlier. What were you saying? You always crack jokes in the worst situations. Ready to hear the conditions for the truce. Okay, Shoot. final mission to go beat up the final boss Don't in his shadow of buddy. This is it, Jeremy. We finished this. Last boss. Shadowy minions. Yeah, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? Gonna get shot in the face three times and we'll be victorious. And, and then and then Ouch. I'm gonna show you David Bowie. I'm gonna show you my There's epic creation in the Dragon's Dogma creator. Don't get too excited. <laughs> Don't get too excited, but I'm I'm impressed. I'm impressed with myself. But I I, I, I'm often impressed with very little things, Slater. lads. It's a minor achievement in my life, but I'm happy with it. Well, see, this is cool. This is cool. This is some Death Star type shit. But it's a bit played out by this point. Free Gomok. Okay. How many buttons do we have to press this time? They're locked on to me. Brought the whole battalion, huh? I'm stuck in the scenery. Oh, the door shut. Ah. What? Is that is that a turret? Bro, this door. <laughs> this door. It's like you know, you know when you go to a you stop at like a hotel that's got like a door sensor and it, it never works. Bro, this door's sensors, motion detectors on the blink. Can't actually get in anymore. Great. <laughs> the door sensors us, us on the blink. Let me in. There we go. Right, let's get inside. It was, it was a turret. I don't miss. Oh, dang. Right, we need to break that guy's barrier. Okay. First switch. I don't know if we can get through this door. Two switches first. Go this way. Headshot. Get in my pocket. See ya. Chest. Oh shit. Execution. Missed him. I was going for the strafe shot there. Kobe! Okay. So it looks like it's making us go like through the through the area backwards here. I'm skipping these guys that born the tits off me. Ah look, there's the door. 
<laughs> What's up, my brothers? So yeah. Somebody else shoot me. Oh damn, that was a bad idea. That's we made a mistake. Mistake, mistake. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Watch it, watch, 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 watch. Nice! Watch the damage. Come on, eat them, eat them, eat them. Those weren't very good against ro I suppose locusts aren't gonna be very good at robots, are they? What could a what could a locust really do to a robot? Nothing. Shouldn't these free leaders' missions be scattered through the whole game instead of all at the end? No, Jeremy. Jeremy, that's that's not very no, they definitely shouldn't. What you need to do is what you need to do is, Jeremy, you need to make the first 18 hours of your game all talking. All just talking about the world. And then what you need to do is you need to condense all of the, the main missions at the end. And you just do them one after the other. Gamers love that shit. Gamers love that shit, Jeremy. These developers know best. <laughs> you do... You made the... Do you know the next Far Cry game? The next Far Cry game is going to have the first 15 hours of it. All cutscene. All learn about the different factions. Why you're there. And what's happening with the politics of the world. And then, instead of having an open map with loads of different outposts that you have to take over, what they're just going to do is they're going to make a linear section at the end of the game with every outpost back to back to back. That's what gamers want. What we want, baby. Right, it's got to be through this. Oh shit, this door's locked. Is this door locked? What's going on here, lads? It was him. I'm po quite possibly dead here. Controls are going ape shit. Oh, this is this is tight. Is this guy dead? He wasn't even dead. We need one more switch to get in there. There it is. Come on, baby, just, just press it, just press it, just press it. Beautiful. Now we can destroy the core and now we can get out of here. Lads, we're excited. This is this is it. Where's the core? Where is the core? Is it through? Shit. Oh, there it is. Got him. We got him. That's it done. We can fast travel out of here. If this doesn't put us like outside the base, we'll just fast travel out. Gotcha. Beautiful. Okay, let's go. Open the meeting room. Oh no, we've got. Shit, I'm glad I didn't fast travel out. We've got to open the meeting room door. This way. Sweet. The meeting room doors upstairs. Is it? Uh, this doesn't seem right. Next Far Cry could spend 15 hours explaining how they brought Vass back from the dead and I'd be on board. I would be on board with that. Vass was... The funny thing is Vass was such a small part of Far Cry 3. 
but he was he was the most impactful. I, I'm not leaving this place. I think that map marker's wrong. The command room door. Oh, this looks good. I shot the guy's leg off. We're in the meeting room. This is the meeting room. Destroy all droids in the meeting room. This guy's body popping. I'll just let him. I'm not allowed to open the chest. Hey, Psst. you're one of Brahms Talanops. What are you doing so far from Dasan? I was tracking our chief unnoticed. I think he's in there. I'm actually looking forward to the next Far Cry game. As basic as they are, I like Far Cry games. I think the shooting in them is good. Hiding again, huh? <laughs> For the last time, my name is Garmok. And I was not hiding. I was studying my next opportunity to escape. Well, here it is. You know what Path my favorite part? Follow that guy, he will lead you back to your village. You know what my favorite part of the Far Cry game is that? It's, it's upgrading the same weapons you've upgraded for the last five Far Cry games. Again, I love getting the Scorpion and putting a silencer on it in every game. I love getting the Bal or whatever whatever rifle. Pardon me, is a is a single tap one shot rifle? Putting a sniper scope on it. All, it's all I do. I live for that shit. Do the same in every Far Cry game. Okay. This has got to be it. We've done everything. Everybody's free. Mission available. You don't want... No. No. Oh, we did actually do this. We did actually... We have got these in our inventory because I collected them just in case. Let's fast travel. There's a mission here. Gather incense. No. I'm going to fast travel here to see if it triggers anything. Come on, can we just trigger the last mission, please? You ever play Far Cry Blood Dragon or Primal? I... I've played Far Cry Blood Dragon. I've never played hurt. Far Cry Primal. He needs the shamas. Both are worth playing. Busy with Gomok. The chief barely made it to Disan alive. You seem bothered. He's free. Isn't that good news? The Zokram amulet is proof that you are the Ulukai. I don't know what your father is trying to prove to us. What if he's just trying to help? Liars don't help, Ulukai. They deceive. You need to pick a side. I have never fired a weapon, and I never will. Yeah, um, I think the reason why I never played Far Cry Primal was simply because it didn't have guns in it. Listen to my daughter, Lias. Camilla is wiser than I ever was. But Blood Dragon was good. I actually played it on my, my friend had it, and I played through it because it was quite a short game, wasn't it? Okay, so... No... No quest? <laughs> This game really, really, really does not want to give us, like, the last quest, does it? It doesn't want us to... Wait, I've got two quests here. Collect portions. I don't want portions. Collect stolen goods. I don't want to collect stolen goods. I would like the end of the game. Let's fast travel here. Maybe this will... Maybe this will trigger something. Yeah, this game definitely does not want us to, to, to finish it. We're trapped. This game's trapped us. I can't cross the spear anymore. Keys are... Daddy, it's me. You copy? Camilla? What are you doing on Liaz's frequency? She's asleep. I 
took her comm link. I don't have much time. It's got guns. They're just made of rocks and sticks and fire a bit slow rate. That's hilarious. She's angry, but not as angry as I was at you. And I came around. You did? I know what you did for the Talans. All of it. And what you did for Mom. What happened to her wasn't your fault. It's all in the past. I don't want to lose you again. I am safe. Liaz is a fierce fighter, but she's not a monster. I think I can convince her to surrender her weapons. If the we don't care. stop attacking humans, Vernon and I can negotiate a ceasefire with Earth Command. I know, Dad. That's been my plan all along. Let me handle this. Liaz is waking up. I have to leave. Slade out. She... She used my name. She's never used that name before. Mate, you know, I've seen her for 20 years. Are you bothered? Still no quest? Do we really have to wait for like intercom messages to progress the game? We just fast travel somewhere else. I think fast travel does like trigger things. This is so pathetic. I'm talking about slings and bows. They don't have a caveman scorpion, unfortunately. Camilla spoke long enough on the calm link so I could locate her position. Awesome. I understand. Well, what I she's went doing. into the thing by accident. I love this. That just the scorpion. I'm what? sending you her last known coordinates. Hurry, they could already be leaving this location. It's in Procriana. Same place Jack's headed for. I need to make it there before he does, or Liaz is in trouble. Hey, this could Slide be the last out. quest. Tim, what we'll do? This is the last quest. It's got to be. New main quest unlocked. Can we just have this as the last quest? Sankira is looming. No. Lads. The menu's broke. I just pressed track mission. Oh, oh. Um. Escape, enter, spacebar. Great. Excellent. Now we... We... <laughs> Game. This game, uh, lads, right. Tell you what, we'll call an episode there. When we come back, we'll do the next mission. Please say it's the last mission. We're nearly there, but the game is bold. I'm gonna have to restart it. See you in the next one, lads. It, it was about time we were gonna call it an episode, anyways. See you in the next one, lads. So it's an alt F4 jobby because the game crashed as we were getting the next mission. Fantastic. Great news. Yeah, sorry. My love for the scorpion actually came from. Call of Duty Modern Warfare, the first one. I used to use it online all the time. It was so good. It had it had no recoil. And it it did so much damage. It was ridiculous. It only had 20 bullets in the clip. That's why not many people used it. But because it did that much damage, you didn't even need them. And it fired so fast. Yeah, the Scorpion. What a banger. Right, tell you what, while this, while this is loading up, lads, I want to take a quick minute break. I just really... I'm not going to be that long. I just need the toilet. And then we'll see if we can finish this. Although... I thought I, I thought I've been at the end of the game for the last six hours, and we haven't. The game just keeps been dragging on and on and on. Absolute dog shit. We'll see. Continue. Right, lads, I'm gonna let that load up. I'm actually just gonna leave it playing in case any people talk to us and give us quests. See you soon. frequency she's asleep i took her calm link i don't have much time send me your coordinates i'm coming to get you no we're finally communicating me and her she's angry but not as angry as i was at you and i came around you did i 
know what you did for the Talans. All of it. And what you well, did for mom. Where am I? What happened to her? Well, where the hell's my guy? It wasn't your fault. It's all in the past. I don't want to lose you again. I am safe. Leaz is a fierce fighter, but she's not a monster. I oh, is this just giving us the dialogue that we saw weapons. before the game crashed? Maybe. Accidentally hit escape there. Not that it matters. Right. I know, Dad. That's been my plan all along. Let me handle this. Leaz is waking up. I have to leave. Slade out. She... She used my name. She's never used that name before. Oh, how hot, how heartwarming. Yeah, so we're still waiting on that quest, aren't we? No, it is. We probably should save the game actually, because uh, it's quite prone to crashing and breaking. Now, <sighs> done. Right. What did we do again? We fast travelled, didn't we? We fast travelled there, and that gave us the quest. Maybe. Yeah, we saw this. Listen to my daughter, Liaz. Camilla is wiser than I ever was. <laughs> you should never have to force trigger Camilla's dialogue. Long enough on the calm link so I could locate her position. Awesome. I understand what she's doing, but she's my daughter. I can help her convince Liaz. I'm sending you her last known coordinates. Hurry. Right. They could already be leaving this location. Okay. It's in Procriana. Same place Jack's headed for. Where I am. get there before he does or Liaz is in trouble. Already Sleep there, out. baby. Right, let's not press this button because it breaks the game. We have to. Oh. We have to do this. Right. Oh, it let me out. It let me out. It let me out that time. It didn't break the game. We were forced into that menu. Right, let's save. Boom. Okay, let's go from here. Right, lads. We've got to go to the Ulakai Museum in Prokrina. Good news is I'm already there. We'll see if we can rescue my, my daughter. How do we get in? I'm here. Mar oh, I don't did you, you know, know where my daughter is, friend? I got thank you. See you. Oh there's there's an, there's an there's an upstairs. I made it. All chiefs are safe and back in their villages. Vernon. Come in. Colonel? Oh shit. I got a bad feeling about this. I'm there. We're there. No! How dare they be so disrespectful to Mar? Uh, Mar, are you okay? We're the only ones here. The Cypher tablet. It's gone. Nobody the cares about missing things. I'm bored oh, of collecting it. Must be here somewhere. I'll help you look for it. No, 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 I won't. Huh? Gotcha. Dirty teeth. Okay, take it easy, Mar. It's not a thief, is it? Pancho? Hey, buddy. Why are you here all alone? Where's the Shana? Hey, come back, thief! Mar will find you. Oh, no. Do we have to find the rat? Chase the rat? Oh, is that it? Liaz. Slade to Liaz. I know you're listening. Answer me. Liaz, I'm sorry I lied to you. I'm doing everything I can to stop the madness I created, but you gotta throw me a line here. I am begging you. The Ulakai does not beg. But you were never the true Ulakai, were you? There's a way out of this. Humans and Talans have to compromise. Compromise? How many of my people have reverted compared to yours? Brothers, sisters, my beloved Yan. 
Some crow will end this conflict. There's something terrible about the Sacra Tablet. It is not what you think. You just want your daughter back. The Ulakai stays with me. She is my secret weapon. You have a daughter, too. Remember that. Let's meet at the temple where it all started. Camilla doesn't have to be there. Just listen to what I have to say, and then you can decide. Fine. The Ganda Temple. We'll talk. But the Ulukai won't be there. See? Compromise. Give me, give me map Thank you, Yes. The biggest problem... Slayed out. The biggest problem I've got with these conversations, you can't skip them. Right, just show me where it is. There it is. How the, I can't believe we didn't actually activate that. We'll go from here. We'll take the big sky thing. But we need to remember, lads, I need to remember not to go in the menu while we're riding this beast. Because we'll have to restart the game. Do not go in menu while riding this. Slade to Vernon. You there? God damn it. Why are you ignoring me? I better hurry to the temple and talk to Liaz. I hope she listens to reason. There's so, there's so much required fast traveling backwards and forwards in this game. It's very, very, very poor. Very poor. It's not even a game like Fallout where you can like encounter things on your way places the world's dead. Right, I'm here. I'm here, baby. That's the Sankar tablet that was stolen from Mars Museum. Why is it here? It's a puzzle. My mother wants me to keep busy with it until she comes back. It's very important I solve it, she said. I think I got a part of it, but it's so hard. The opposite of fun. The tablet warns the Talans about the four essences shifting out of balance. Sankra will drown this world in chaos. Your mother needs to understand this happened to Earth before How and then- How dare you feed your lies to my daughter? Lias, listen to me. I only listen to the Yods. Sankra is not the way of the Yods, Lias. Your anger will destroy everything. The tablet is no a warning. No more lies! You gotta be strong enough to handle the truth. I wasn't. I knew the invaders were human, and I didn't tell you because I thought you were too angry to trust me, so I Which lied is. for your own good. And hiding the identity of my father? Also for my own good? What? Oh, goddamn Comlink, look. I'm sorry you overheard my conversation with Yal and Kizar, but you are not your fatherly ass. Even though you have his temper. Croax was weak. I won't repeat the mistakes of my father. I won't collaborate with humans who lie and deceive. I am here to compromise, Lias, remember? Let's make peace for the Yods, for everyone. Only the Almael understands the will of the Yods. Then I'll talk to the Almael. Can you at least tell Camilla I love her? She knows. She has been listening to our conversation through my comlink. You gotta help me, baby girl. She promised me not to answer. And the Ulakai is a woman of her words. Ads, what absolute nonsense is this story? Did, did we really just go there to have that conversation? Could it, would it not have been a better idea? The last Played. combat mission we had. Could they not have just condensed this into one com one cutscene and then had us go and do a mission? Took some time to secure a new one. You talked to Lias? She ready to surrender her weapons and join the ambassadors? Not exactly. She won't listen to me, but I know who can convince her. I'm on my way to Kizar. Wait. I'm on my way to Kizar. Come on then. Lads, we're gonna get the jump. I'm already i I'm already traveling there before we even are told to. I'm on my way to Kizar. Talk to more people, no doubt, no doubt in my mind. We'll watch them. We'll watch another sixteen shit cutscenes. We'll we'll see Girl. how it goes. Oh, these comlinks really suck. 
Go to Kizar and warn Yell of the dangers of the Sankara. Right, okay. There we go. Just here. <sighs> Thank you, Father, for I have sinned. Thank you for giving me this day. Lads, we're actually here. Warning you about to enter a critical stage of your journey once you proceed beyond this point. Give it to me! Please just give me the credits. Do you want to save? Yes. If this is the credits, I'll be happy. Let's go, baby. Yell! Please let me in! Yell! Oh, that's useless. There's no way I'm getting through the spear. <laughs> well, that's this. We're there. We're there. What are you doing here? Yell. You heard me. I didn't hear you. I felt your presence. We share a special bond. I, I know. I feel it too. There's not a lot of time before Alma finds out that I breached the spear to meet you. So speak. Liaz and her Zonsankers are about to cause the extinction the Yods warned us about. How? A way of Sankar will swallow the world and how do I put this? A series of serious shitstorms. My dimension already got this treatment. It wasn't pretty. I will talk to Liaz. I think she's ready to compromise. One out of two Alma males should be good enough to convince her. Thank you, Yell. You cannot stay here. So this is goodbye, I guess. Yeah. So be it. Go the Mayao has half. Go on. Oh. You got shot. Oh, I got shot. Oh, she got shot. Spoken. Bro, we didn't even get. You see that? They were about to kiss. Disgusting. General, have you lost your mind? Oh, did I hurt your little friends, Lieutenant Colonel Vernon? I've known about your betrayal for a while now. I should execute you for treason. Want to redeem yourself, Colonel? Shoot the alien. Now the music, lads. The music. Screw you, Burrum. <laughs> Miserable coward. That's who wrote this. No. Yell. You gotta come back. I can't lose you. Oh, great. We get to walk about this thing again. Save us from extinction. Nazorkat Ama Nur Nekar. What's the, what's the point? Save us from extinction. Both humans and Talans were threatened all along. That's the message of the Yods. To prevent both races extinguishing each other. No. <sighs> It took many sacrifices to understand the true meaning of the Yod's message. Yell, Colonel Vernon, they were both from different dimensions, but they both trusted me to complete one mission.
collective mission. One that I could never have accomplished all by myself. I'm very grateful to Camilla and to Liaz, who have agreed to join me as ambassadors of this event. Get that last exposition in before the credits roll, Jesus. And I want what to a lot of zort, I agree. Here today. During oh. my time on Adelpha, I learned that we are not so different. WFA, Dalatai Guardians, humans, or Talans. At the end of the day, we all hope for the same things. Safety for our children. Oh, it's to be worthy me. as a father. Or as a daughter. To look our brother in the eye and realize that we are all brothers and sisters after all. Connected like one big club. Bonding over the simplest and most beautiful concept of all. The only one everybody in this room has in common. And it's not death or aversion. It's life. A force of nature as powerful as a Galenta but thriving in a fragile shell. It is our responsibility not to break peace. Speeches, speeches like that are what cause wars. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to welcome to this What's very happening? stage the highest representative of the Talan What's nation, happening? Alma Yell, the Alma Yell. Is this a dream? Where we just got shot and then... It's going to be fine, Liaz. Chill. I'm chilled. But is it me? Or is it getting hot in here? And as far as the moons remember, we are the keepers of all Yod's creations. We are home. She ain't following the script. There should be more Dolatai guardians here. Where are they? This repulsive human reverted my sister in yes. blood. None of his eloquent words could save her. She is extinct. Assassinate him, go on, baby. Renounce false prophecies and give faith to our makers if the yards can't save us no one will Somebody just shoot. Lads, listen, we're, go we're, we're going to start a rebellion. We're going to start a rebellion. What we're going to do is, lads, we're going to storm this place. Storm it with your guns. Yeah, shouting and screaming. But what you're going to do is you're going to stand there and not do anything for at least eight or ten minutes so the reinforcements can come. What a load of nonsense. This game is held together with chewing gum. Oh, is this the boss? Is this, lads, wait, 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 lads. I'm calling it now, I'm calling it now. This guy is exactly the same boss as we fought the previous five times. What have you done, Alma? It is, it actually is. It's the same boss. Instead of having a blue biome, we've got, we've got this room instead. <laughs> oh, yes, lads, Not I never good. expected anything less. I hope this is the last boss. WFA officer. <laughs> it's, a it's the same boss. This is a massacre. Blurry. 
definitely not the kind of piece I had in mind. I thought he was frozen. I was just waiting for to see if he was actually frozen. He wasn't. Right in the bollocks. There you go, game over. This game was written by Chat. Do you know what it is, Jeremy? I actually think the game was written by ChatGPT. I can't follow what's going on here at all. Jeremy, there's no, there's no consistency. There's no guiding the player with what's actually happened. It just seems like a load of cutscenes that they made. They got a team full of people and just said, make random cutscenes with the characters from this game, and they were given the characters. And then, without, without talking to each department. They made cutscenes and then the threw them all together and tried to make it cohesive. What are you waiting for? General! I hope that was the last boss. That was the last boss, wasn't it? To be fair, we did skip all the cutscenes and all the dialogue. I mean, we did. <laughs> I mean, we did. I mean, we did. I watched all the cutscenes up until about the 18 hour mark. And then I realized they're all dog shit. So I, I think Humans the four or five cutscenes that I did skip, you have offered your essence I don't think they would have helped. Of peace between worlds. You are united in this realm and beyond. Regret. I hope she reverted us to the cuts, the the credits. Whenever I see these portals, we funny enough, and this guy, I don't understand. Whenever I see these portals, it actually reminds me of Mortal Kombat, the realms. Where are the soldiers? <laughs> the odds. They made us all revert together. Wild, right? First time is the weirdest. It gets better, trust me. Help me, please, Ulagai! Nefaim, what's happening here? The spear. It's gone. We were told you all reverted dozens of moons ago. Now the humans are massacring females and children. The Zon Sankras are losing the battle. Kizar is doomed. Where's Alma? The Almael is using Halidium to protect herself. She's retreated to the center of the city. I don't know how long she could keep this up before. Before. Oh no. They found me. Take cover. <laughs> With low rent Raiden coming through the portal. Exactly. Exactly. I like low rent Raiden. God of Thunder. Ooh, do we have the power of the odds? Oh, let's. Here we go. Ooh, you obtained the echo power. Oh, lads. Here they come. We've got laser beams and shit. How epic is this? Yeah, baby. Camilla, are you freezes everyone. Good. Mar showed me a shortcut to the center of Kizar. I'll meet you there. Stay hidden and close to Mar. He runs too fast and I lost him, but don't worry, I'll be fine. Slay him. Uh, I'd rather just shoot them in the face, but I mean, it is what it is. By the yards. Oh, fools. This war will destroy us all. 
don't think we can run out of this energy. Oh, we can. Why am I losing energy? Follow lit. Oh no. No, we, we we have to follow this woman. Baby? Just what I needed. Eh. Uh. Oh, now she's okay. Okay. So, so, okay. Watch out, Lias. There are more of them. Oh, great. I just caught lads. I just can't contain my excitement. They keep coming, stay close. I might actually lads, I might actually die here because I can't get health back. Because we're not allowed my weapon. Forgot we can block like. Okay, we've mastered we mastered this. Come on, baby. Stay behind me. Over. We have to take care of these two. Flowing. I'm trying. I need some health back. Baby, can you give me some help? I'm on, I'm on one bar. Watch out! More enemies ahead. Oh, great. Oh, dang. This is so shit. It's so bad. I mean, I'm in, I'm in, a, I'm in the water. Didn't you just give a speech about how peace and love is the point of it all? Ah oh, well, back to blasting fools, exactly. Lads, the only way for true peace is by war and destruction. Uh, everything's dead, baby. Can we can we progress? Are we permanently stuck there? Coming back. She's coming, she's on the way, she's on the way. We're all good, we're all good. I don't, know, I don't know if I'm on board with this this really bad power that we've got. I feel like we'd be doing a better job if we just give us guns. I think my gun was more powerful than this thing. I can one-shot things with it. I can't one-shot things with this this god fist. My gun was more powerful than the gods. Can we fly? Oh, come on. Let's go fly. Oh 
More fun ahead. Be ready, Liaz. I use my special move there, which instantly froze them. I've got to wait a lot of recharges. I've got to... So if you use your special move that freezes them, it doesn't count as freezing them for the mission. So we had to wait for the hand to recharge. Good to know. Feel my yod fist. <laughs> it tingles. Yo lads, we've got yod fist all over. All over our enemies. Um, imagine making this your last mission in the game and being proud of it. Come on, Cutter. Keep I didn't know there was another one. We nearly died there. We were so close to dying. I like how we can just run through these guys' bodies as well. They're not actually blocking the, the way. But this is it, we're at the palace. Come on. Give me the final showdown. It's the final countdown. You cannot stay here. I'm taking you with... <gasps> Camilla! I got her! Alma, talk to me! I know how you feel! I miss L2! Wait, you didn't even get a kiss of her? Look at you, Slade. Such a seducer. You gotta have them all, don't you? Until they all die in your arms. I'm here to take care of that. For Marion. Proper boss. Oh, not really. <clears throat> this is pathetic. I'll just hide behind here while my hand recharges. It's all right. I'll just stand here. It's I love over. I love waiting you can still stop this. for godlike powers to recharge. We probably could have two shot this guy. This thing that we're doing does 20 damage per second. Actually, it probably does quite a lot more than that. Let us pass. That doesn't even damage us. Yo, that, that guy's bullets doesn't even hurt us. I'm not even gonna dodge. Oh, okay, I probably should have dodged. Daryl, brother, how's it going? Is this game getting better? No, no, it, it's getting worse. This game's impressive that it gets worse the longer you play. It's exponentially worse. I think this. I think that was the last boss. I think that was the most amazing last boss you've ever seen in your life. Such innovation, such wow. He's getting closer to not having to play it anymore. That's right. 
That definitely does count as getting better, Jeremy. Spear into a weapon. She's going to destroy the orbital portal. Come on, let me tickle her with my laser beam. I guess the best defense. God damn it, Alma! I'm the one who taught you that. Frieza? I only attended the peace conference to figure out the exact location of the portal. My new spear targets it. Dad, if she succeeds, we'll all be gone in seconds. Humans and Talans. Fingers crossed, baby. A damaged portal would only result in a new vortex. What's over, misery? One of massive extinction. Assessing. Cool down complete. Well, yes, there's no cover. Get Camille out of here. So, pulling the shield down was some kind of trap to lure me here. A suicidal strategy. Fool. Or oh, do we get to fight this guy again? We get to fight this guy again. He's got three health bars this time. That's fine. That's fine. We'll tickle him with our ice beam. Great. What is this game we're playing, please? <laughs> Sounds like you're underwater, it's so weird. The sound effects are actually wild. Stay close to me to keep the echo flowing. Stay close to you, I don't even know where you are. I think I'll just fly about. Bro, I've got straight up Superman powers, look at this. Don't oh, he shit, he nearly killed me. Actually, nearly, he nearly killed me, I'm dead. Mission failed, game over, give me the credits. I hope there's, I hope there's no, I hope this is permadeath. It's so boring. It's so boring. The gameplay, what, what is this boss? Why did it take my guns away? I don't want these godlike power. Oh my god, we gotta do it from. Do we have to do it from. We can do the whole thing again! Right lads, we'll, we'll actually play properly. Bro, we've gotta start from the beginning. <laughs> this is entirely my own fault for being a dickhead. We just get to play the game for longer, lads. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry about it. You don't have the healing power from your good. Exactly, do Jeremy. It's took everything away from us that we, we used to win. I feel like a really ghetto Iron Man. I need to wait for this thing to recharge. We do get energy. We do get energy back for getting hit when we're holding down the shield. I like how that was explained. That's what killed us last time. Almost activated her weapon. I need to get rid of Jack so I can focus on her. Got any energy? Baby! Baby, you need to channel some more energy. I've got no damage dealing skills. Don't wander too far, Ulakai. Come back. Yes. Oh, I can't see one. Come on, shoot me because I've got no energy.
Oh, shoot, shoot me, shoot me. <laughs> what is this? What is this? What is this? Who, who, who thought this was... Like, this, this, this can one-shot me, I think, so let's just be careful here. Stay close to me to keep the echo flowing. If you, if you air strafe, it can't hit you. Like, go on, shoot me, because I need the energy back. Air strafe, it can't hit you. I'm risking it for a chocolate biscuit. I'm just going full send. We did it. We did it. Prepare for stage three, where it's now got four health bars. I can't wait. He's retreating. You did it. Oh, you don't know the man. His ship is critically overclocked and about to explode. General, don't do this. Run for your life, Camilla. This ain't about you. You don't have to die. All those years, I've spent raising you like my own. You were quick at erasing them, at erasing me. I'd rather fail than fade away. Dad, please. You gotta stop him. Assessing. Jetpack overheating. What are you doing? Well, Aki C. This is the origin story of Dr. Robotnik. Assessing. Jetpack malfunction. Reduce overclocking. Slade, you really think I'd drop the fight so easily? I'm taking you down with me, and the alien witch too. He's going to crash on the Amayan. Assessing. Jetpack status critical. Self-destruction imminent. That's enough deaths for me. We're saving this guy. Are you kidding me? I would have put, I would have strapped that to the guy and sent him flying. Does everyone live happily ever after? Daryl, bro, that's so funny. Super Nintendo boss fights. Super Nintendo did boss fights better than this. This they managed to do it worse. Imagine where this is going in Outcast 3. I know. They can't be Outcast 3 though, because this has just had 3,000 year old super mature cheese of a cutscene where the war is over. Peace and prosperity. It's. Uh, we, they need to dead this series in the water. It's never been good. It's never been good. 
May the bells of Melia carry our words across the whole planet. And beyond. Our message speaks to humans and to lands. For a new beginning. I know why this game was so bad. This game, the first game, Outcast came out in about 1999. Quite good for the time. It, was, it dealt with a few like relatively state of the art mechanics, open world, you can go wherever you want. It was a lot of games like that were quite new at the time. But it feels like this sequel has been like 23 years in development and they've just kept everything the same as if it was from 1999 that's the end of the game what an ending lads my life has been changed that that made me that lads that was so mind blown i don't think i'll ever recover from the epicness of that ending it was like a cinematic marvel lads i'm, I'm being facetious the, the fucking game was shit the game, this game was shit from start to finish. I don't even like the menus. I don't even like the logo. Um, right, okay, let's be positive. What, what was good about the game? The world looked nice. The graphics were sharp. It wasn't like, well, then again, this wasn't like any normal modern day game. It wasn't like a modern day game where everything's blurry because they put so many effects on the screen at once. I like games looking like this. I think the game looked good. Everything else was shit. And I don't even want to talk about it anymore. Lads, hope you enjoyed the playthrough. See you in the next one. Lads on stream. Lads on stream. What we've got for you now is something extra special. Let me just quickly, quickly before we log off, uh, let me quickly put them in their folder, Outcast 2, so we can prepare to uninstall this game. We need to... <laughs> Jeremy Darrell. <laughs> um, Punk, if you're still there. Let's show you the the a little sneak peek into my creator characters for dragon's dogma on monday <laughs> lads this is a behind the scenes look great review cheers for that jeremy <laughs> it's not even worth i don't ever want to i don't even want to talk about this game ever again ever again it was tragic from start to finish i am um, it's look the game's actually lucky it got finished the only reason we finished that game was because I didn't want to start a new game before Dragon's Dogma 2 because I'm deaf I'm starting Dragon's Dogma 2. It's a game I've been looking forward to for ages. Um a bit disappointing Dragon's Dogma was released on a Friday and not a Tuesday because we could have had like a full week playing it. But instead like I'm I'm normally busy at weekends. I just had a few spare hours today where I wanted to get that finished. And then we can go full force let me just set up the capture software so you can see what I'm doing. This game would have done well in 2008. <laughs> okay. Modern software. Where are you? That's in, that's in a window where they were weird. A bit weird. Right, so instead of, let's duplicate this. We'll just call it that, that's fine. Delete that. Say yeah. Add a new scene. Display capture. Cancel, sorry. Add game capture. We want, we'll just call that a load of letters because I'll be changing it properly for Dragon's Dogma. Um, okay. Specific window. Dragon's Dogma, baby. Okay. Right, that should be looking okay for you now. When it's full screen, it should be full screen, I think. Alright, let's have a look. Right, lad. For some reason, the Dragon's Dogma character creator is really weird. Like, even though I run it at, like, full screen, it, um, if I alt tab out of it, it goes back into a window. I hope the main game doesn't do that. But I'm just waiting to see if this comes up full screen. It does. It's come up full screen for you guys. Do you like the style of the natives? <laughs> <laughs> the natives from Outcast. Right, so let me show you lads. Little sneak peek. Oh one thing, one thing I need actually. Not that you need to see my my face. I'm forcing you to look at me here. But right, there we go, that should be better. Dogma. Yeah, weird. 
when you alt and tab out of Dragon's Dogma, just the character creator, because this is just the correct character creator, it windows it for some reason. I, I don't know why. So, lads, here we go. Right, let me show you my guy. We'll show you my guy first, and I'll show you David Bowie. Don't get too excited. I, I just think it's funny. I think I think he looks good. We'll see. So this is my guy. This guy we're playing as generic guy one. Basically, I went into the character creation. I chose a couple of default options and I added a beard and some hair. This is our guy that we're playing as. This is this is me, right? This is me here. Looks like a bit of a legend. We are making him a thief for reasons I've explained. I wanted to go magic archer. We know that's not a class we can pick from the start. We can only pick from four classes. I would have went with archer. Problem is, they've removed daggers from the archer. No longer can a da an archer engage in melee combat. It's a bit disappointing. I don't know why they changed that. But I like John Cena and people from the top ropes, and we can't do that with an archer, so we're starting with Thief. When we do finally find the magic archer vocation, and we can switch to it, we'll try it out. But in the meantime, we're going Thief. That armor looks terrible. We will definitely not be wearing that armor. The archer armor looks cool. I don't think you start with this armor. This is normally just like a sneak peek. Dragon's Dogma 1 did this. So this is our guy. This is our guy, right? But that's that's not why you're here. That's not why. Um, back. So we're, be, we're being accompanied by David Bowie's, David Bowie's joining us. He went through Dragon's Dogma 1 with us and he's coming at Dragon's Dogma 2 with us. Look at this guy, lads. I'm quite impressed. Don't get too excited. Look at this, lads. If squint, if you squint your eyes really, just squint them. Shut your eyes. Just shut your eyes and think of David Bowie. Bro, look at this. We've come so far. We've run so far. Your eyes. It doesn't look anything like him, right? But the biggest problem with the Dragon's Dogma character creator is you don't get many hairstyles. There's only, well, there's 57 hairstyles in all. They're, that actually, look, look, when we cheat, that looks like David Bowie. Does it not? I think I've done a good job. I actually think there's one hairstyle. There's one hairstyle that makes him look like, like, like David Bowie before he died. Let me see if I can find it. When he had short hair. He actually looks really good, but we're not giving it. There, look, lads, doesn't that look, that's a spitting image of David Bowie with that hairstyle, isn't it? He looked, that's what he looked like before he died. But we're giving him this hairstyle. I know it's not, we're giving him this hairstyle because he looks like Jarrett from Labyrinth. And it's the best that could do with it. We want that like silhouette. We want that 80s perm. Envy brother, I really want it to be Monday. I want to see this. Play. I can't wait. I can't wait either. I can't wait. But what I'm going to do is, like, after this stream, which we'll be finishing up after we chat some shit now, I'm going to uninstall the game, which we will never speak of again. I'm going to install Dragon's Dogma. I want to make sure it's all running. So we're all ready to go flying on Monday. And um, David Bowie. So, yeah, we're going with... Although this hairstyle does actually look quite good for David. I think that does look good. It's a bit short though. I wish this kind of had like hair, a bit of a fringe, so he could truly be David Bowie from Labyrinth. But I think that's a good silhouette. I think I like this one because of how wild it is. The eyeshadow is fantastic. Jeremy, look at the eyeshadow. David Bowie, bro, that is Dave. I've even done the eye look at how he's got one name, big pupil and a blue eye. Bro, the detail I went, I've spent, I've probably spent, <laughs> I've spent it in a, a I'm ashamed of how long I've spent in this. Where's Steam? Where's Steam? Let me find out how long I've actually spent in this character creator. My character took me less than five minutes to make. This guy. I've, I've <laughs> every, t every time I get a few spare minutes, I jump back into this character creator and see if I can make some changes. Right, Steam. Steam normally tells you how, how long you've played something for. Library. Time played. I'm not even telling you how long I've played this for. I've been in this character creator for 3.6 hours. <laughs> 3.6 hours. Are you me? He's back. I hope that the negative reviews don't scare you while playing Dragon's Dogma 2. Well, 
Yeah, Daryl is not he's not dead. He's back. He's back from the dead. He's he's coming with us. So that's it. That that's that's our guy, and he's gonna be a mage. Let me just exit this. Exit character creator. We're not saving it. And um, back, back, back. Oh, one thing I did want to. Sh I think. Do you know when there's a bit of shadow? Like, look at my guy there. It looks. It looks like the guy David Bowie and Labyrinth. It's so good. Okay, so that's it. That's the character creator. Um. Yeah, I don't. I've seen a few negative reviews of Dragon's Dogma 2, but they're mainly surrounded the, the there's there's some stuff you can buy with real money. Well, I think the biggest controversy is when you start a game, there's no option in the main menu to start a new game. People think that you're stuck with your first character, and it is quite funny because I've read a few reviews saying, "Oh, I made it. I made a ridiculous character for for fun, a troll character with his face all hanging off and stuff, and I can't change it." <laughs> it's what you get for making a shit character, mate. But you can. You just got to go into the game files and delete your save game. I always, on all the games I play, because obviously like technology can go go wrong and stuff, I always make a backup of my 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 save game. So if we do want to restart for whatever reason, we we can delete the save game. So that's a non-issue. And they were saying if you want to change your character's appearance, you have to spend two pound, two real British pounds to buy a item that allows you to change your character's appearance. Or you can play the game for 10 minutes, earn some rift crystals from your pawn like you could in the first game and go to the shop in the first town and buy a, a character respec. It, it, it's a non-issue. People people like to blow a lot of things out of proportion. And the only other bad thing I've heard about the game is one that I am actually a bit worried about, is the performance. I've heard the performance is not great. I've heard that the game is quite a big CPU hog. My CPU is okay. I've got an 11800H. It's old now. It's probably three to four years old. And I do record my game so I get an extra frame per second hit there however I still think we're going to hit a constant 60 frames per second because I always lock my games at 60 can you give him blue fit you can actually watch lad I'll show you what you can do while we're here I'll show you what you can do in the in the character creator I only just learned this uh, when I was playing about because the the character creator even though it's even though it's quite good it um a few things are in some like really weird places. So for example, how I gave my guy how I gave my guy the, the eyeshadow from Labyrinth is I looked everywhere for like a way to add stuff. I couldn't find it. And then I was messing about with the tattoos. So what I've actually done is this tattoo I've placed is actually a body tattoo. And I'll show you vertical position 56. So this is the body tattoo and I just made it small. I just made it small and like put it where it was. Like there. There is an option for some eyes like he's got like eye shadow on now, but that was a separate option in the eyes tab. But if you want to like add things and scars you can do body tattoos, you can add tattoos to the left and right arms, scar presets. Add some scars and stuff. Um The character creator is quite good. I, I'm not I'm not normally one for spending too much time in character creators. Especially for for making like my main character. As long as my main character's got a beard and some hair on his head, I'm not really bothered. Um but when it's David Bowie, we had to spend some time. Reset scar presets. What other things can you do? Other than that, I've never really played about. The faces are quite good. I'm a bit disappointed with the hairstyles. There needs to be more hair. Most of the hairstyles in the in the game, I would think, are like girls' hairstyles. I mean, it's a lot of them. Like the that's not really a man's hairstyle. That's definitely a woman's hairstyle. Um. But I think. We, we probably could have gotten away with a hundred. If we, if we had a hundred hairstyles to choose from, it might be nice. Facial hair, body hair. You, but you can change the full body, like uh, your, your height. 
You can make your guy an absolute monster if you want. 215 centimeters tall. Bro. I kind of, I tried to make... Now, there's a thing, lads. If you're... He needs grey titan and eye-catching bolt, Jeremy. I don't know if they've got the same armour. If they, I don't know if they've got the same armour from Dragon's Dogma 1. But in Dragon's Dogma 1, you could get grey tights with the Bowie bulge in them. The only thing that stopped us from doing that in Dragon's Dogma 1 was because Bowie's a mage. Proceed with this change. Cancel. Reset a default. Um, can we toggle equipment? Wait there, toggle equipment. Let me have a look. X. See, normal outfits for mages are like this sack of taties that they wear. Some really basic armor you can use, like pants. I think we could probably give him basic pants in a basic white shirt to make him look like Labyrinth Bowie. I'll probably go through the game with that, to be honest. Um, I don't really want him wearing something like this, but I think what Dragon's Dogma generally do with their classes is a lot of the actual class armor looks the same. Like I think most mages are going to be wearing a big dress like that. <laughs> That's most mages wear dresses. He starts to look like Christine Bransky with woman's hair. Wait there, let's find out who that is. Christine. Ah, Baransky. <gasps> is Christine Baransky the woman from American Pie? Oh, it's not. I see who she is now. I see who she is now. There's a striking resemblance. <laughs> that hair, though, kind of fire. It is. It is. I want. I wanted the. Although it's not. It's not the 80s perm I would have liked to have gotten. It's got the silhouette of, of what I want. And also, lad, look, it's even got. Because if you look at the Labyrinth movie, David Bowie and the Labyrinth movie, although his hair is like really light blonde, if you look closely, because I've studied the movie in depth, it's my favourite movie of all time, lads, he's actually got certain pink highlights and blue highlights. So we've got slightly pink tips there. Bro, what am I doing with my life? Am I really am I really talking about a guy's highlight colours in his hair? <laughs> what? So he's got a slight pink tinge to the hair. And that eye makeup is straight up fire. So lads, we're excited for Monday. Lads, what we'll do is we'll call it we'll call it an end of the stream there. Can't wait for Monday. I want to create all my thumbnails and stuff. Probably now I think I've got about... What time is it? It's bloody hell, it's, it's it's quarter to six already. Ah, shit. We, I suppose we've been on outcast for like over three hours. I did not think it was going to take me three hours to finish that game. I've a... Do you know what's, you know what's on the menu for night? KFC. Zinger stacker box meal. Extra supercharger sauce. That's happening tonight. Also, to be fair, I hope that you find a big sword in your playthrough and wipe all the enemies out with it like Sken. Envy. From what I've heard, they've changed the system a little bit from Dragon's Dogma 1, which I think is a good thing. Before, you had to spend your level up points add an in to switch classes so let's just say for example we've got the four classes four starting classes there so you didn't want to change classes all the time because then you wouldn't have enough level up points to buy skills and abilities so you had to plan it i think they've changed it in this game you only need to buy the class once and you've got it unlocked and you can switch to it anytime you want so although with our main character we are going to be starting as a thief because I think it's going to be the, ble the best, most fun playstyle. When we do unlock the warrior, which is your two-handed fighter, we're definitely going to try it out. I didn't like the two-handed warrior in Dragon's Dogma 1. I found it really, really slow. It was nowhere near as good as skin. 
but they might have changed it in Dragon's Dogma 2. So we're definitely going to try it out. But for the most part, we're playing Thief until we unlock Magic Archer, I think. And David Bowie's going to be a mage to help us heal and stuff. But I think we can... In Dragon's Dogma 1, I'm pretty sure you could only have... I think you could only have one extra pawn, like with a total of two pawns in your main character. I think in this one, they've upped it to three pawns. So you, your main pawn, and two pawns dragged from the rift. So we could have like a, a full-on fellowship of the ring following us about. I think it could be a lot of fun. It could be good. So lads, that's it. Have a great evening. Have a great Saturday. Have a great chilled Sunday, lads. And I'll see you on Monday. It's going to be epic. It's going to be a lot of John Cena and off the top ropes. There's going to be a lot of exploration. I'm going to slay a lot of goblins. And there's going to be an exceptional amount of dance magic dance on some bitches with David Bowie. Bro, he's going to light people up when we get him some spells. I can't wait can't wait jump magic jump magic jump magic jump let me exit this make sure i don't make any changes that i don't want perfect perfect lads take care all the best see you on monday